Well, hey, how's it going? Um, I want to do a video showing you an up close of uh, what this bed actually is. So let's take a second and check it out. Well, all right. It's got the, all the original wood in it, I believe. It looks it. It's got a little bit of rust, uh, I mean rot down there, but not too bad. Probably just going to sand it up and save it. It looks solid as hell. I mean, solid as hell. The, the gate, the gate is, is perfect. Oh. I'm going to have to undo it. I have to undo it. Whatsoever. No rot. It's probably a indoor truck, maybe. Probably had a shop. But well, as you can see in there, the metal is all good. Solid as a rock. I'm loving it. The fender's got some bondo. But they need a little bit of work. I'll have to check them all out. Right here. I need some addressing. The back looks good. The wood right here is, is rotted right here. But the rest of this is solid. Wedge pieces to uh, mount it to the frame. And then these these rails are steel. This one has a little bend up in it, but I'm not sure what this was for. Did somebody cut a hole in it? Maybe it was a tow truck or something before. Who knows? So scores on the new bed. So let me know what you guys think. And maybe you can give me some info on the, the three hinge and I'll get a tape measure and measure how big this bed is. Well, I can tell you the bed, the whole length of it is Looks like with the, the thing closed, probably 58 inches. So almost five feet. And from side to side, just the bed itself is 46 and a half. And from outside of the fender to the outside of the fender is 67 or 66 and a half. So that's that. That's your measurements. That's in really good shape. I don't know what you want to see. What questions you got. But this definitely got some mud on it. That I'd love to take off. It looks like someone cut it and added a piece in. Which I don't like. I don't like that kind. But really solid. It looks like you can tell the original because they're square. Square nuts. It, you know? Even on the... Oh, you can't see on the rails, but even on the rails. And they're flathead screws. You see them? So, I mean, and this is the rotted piece of wood, and, and it's really solid as hell. It's not even rotted, and this is solid oak.
I'm gonna sand that down. I don't even know. Look at how thick it is. Look at how thick that is. I'm gonna have to get a piece of that. Oh, it looks like they added two pieces together to get the right thickness. Maybe I can take this apart and then cut this square and add a piece to it. Fix it, repair it. It's gonna be a long time, but she should come out good. And across, let me measure across the back here. Yeah, so it's square too. It's exactly the same as back there, 46 and a half. We'll see how square it is. Measure it from this corner. Oh, we dizzy can't see. We got 76. Uh, 75 and 7 eighths. Oh boy. Are you kidding me? I don't know if you can see that. But it's 75 and 7 eighths on both sides. Diagonal. So that's square as a fucking square could be. For its age, that's pretty awesome. So, uh, Road King, tell me all about this. I need the history um, in HO Motorsports. There's definitely a little piece of something. Okay, it takes all kinds. She's been going in her trunk for an hour now. I don't know if I can set it down so you can see it. Probably not. Sorry about that. Well, I've taken one of these off and to, to let you guys see all the rust and stuff, there isn't any. There's like none. I know you can't really see it, but there's like hardly any. Let's see if you can see it. There's a little body filler that seeped through right there. That's straight as hell. And the bolts are good. Got the fender off. And here's the piece. Get this made up a new one. Two of them and we'll be good. Now I gotta do some work on the two fenders. But here, look at this. This is all solid as can be. both of them off. They uh, got a little bit of bondo on the inside. I don't know why. Because it's solid as hell. Maybe because this wood was rotted. But um, it looks good. Solid as hell. Looks really well all the way down. I did notice right here. You see this? This right here has a little kick in a little bit. But I can bang that out. But it looks great. So I'm going to have both of these made new ones. And uh, we'll uh, undercoat all of this. Put the POR on it and make it nice. But now I'm just going to... Uh, bring the fenders inside and probably cover her back up 
Well, hey, that was a day, I'll tell you that. I got the fenders off, I got those wood boards off, the, I think they're the, uh, the mounting support boards. And it looks like they used a one inch, a one and a quarter inch piece of oak with a three quarter inch piece of oak. So it's like uh, an inch and a half thick or something, solid oak. So I'm going to have to have one of my buddies uh, make that up for me. Not that I can't, but I got other things to do. And it's better to have more hands helping, you know. But I want to take one second before I end this video to apologize to uh, my boy Cutworm. Cutworm, sometimes you dizzy, you know. They call me dizzy for a reason, okay. They call me dizzy for a reason. That's all I'm going to say. And I apologize. Comment, like, subscribe. Check out the links below. And as always, it's your hardcore, you dizzy swag.